on YouTube, I see a lot of people going on about survival knives and how everyone's looking for a one tool option. This is my take on it. But this is my one tool option if I ever had to need one. Now don't get me wrong, I love my survival knives, I love my bush tool, I love my sword, as you've seen in my other videos. But out of all of them, this right here is my favorite, if not competing with the Habilis for my favorite. I'll show you why. It can carve feather sticks, as I'm going to demonstrate with this. And you can also strike a ferro rod on the back. It's got a 90 degree spine. This is a carbon steel tomahawk. It's the um, trailhawk you saw in my, one of my first videos. Bring it back. So let's get the test started. This thing has pretty shallow profile. If I had to describe it, it'd be like kind of a scandy grind. Let me show you how well it carves. Small work. You can see, made a pretty good feather stick. Not bad for two and a third, for a little bit over a two inch blade. Now for the other test. Striking the ferro rod. See how she performs. And I know I'm gonna get sparks off of it. Just want to demonstrate it for the camera. There's sparks off the back of that spine pretty nicely. Edge on this thing is pretty easy to sharpen. It stays pretty sharp as you saw our feather stick that we made by hand. This thing is pretty much my favorite go-to tool. If I had to choose anything else and this was on the table, I'd take this over, say, some, something from a higher-end custom maker. This thing's here to stay, in my opinion. It is by far one of my favorite tools up there with my bush tool that you saw me beat the heck out of and my sword bowie that I talk a lot about, even though that thing's more of a chopper, not necessarily a survival blade. Well. That was stupid. It is a survival blade, but it also fulfills the role of chopper. As you can see, this thing's been heavily modified. Did that so, for one, it would be uncoated to strike your ferro rod with it. And two, it just looks a lot better. So, for $30, as I said in my other previous review of this, you can't go wrong. This thing is here to stay at least from at least for a long time <laughs> so if you like this video be sure to drop a like subscribe I'll try not to take so long with the rest of my videos but school's coming up so we'll just have to wait and see about that I am getting some new gear in and look forward to that there's gonna be 
Absolutely. And SE uh, Laser Strike. I'm going to be doing a review over that, along with some other things. So stay tuned for that, and I'll try to have that out probably around first or second week of April. So look forward to that.